all right so what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel man it's your boy and i'm back with some more baylock content for you and my girl is a slap machine come on oh come on i was hoping to one shot this phase or at least two shot it but not quite so like i told you guys in the first video she doesn't have very many tags for world boss so her primary value is going to be for ABX ABL, which you're not going to be able to see the full extent of it until obviously we get her up to a uh, tier four. But I will do some testing, maybe at 80? No, nah. 80 and 70 for ABX and ABL don't really make that big of a difference. So I might just try her and see how she does at 70. Lots of fun to be had. Oh. I need to get into the habit of... I know I'm supposed to instant cancel the third, but every time she does that move where she rocks back, it reminds me of her previous uniforms, where she would rock back and like kind of charge up and then release the clones, right? <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> It's just been programmed into my head that when I see that move, just hold the charge, you know? <laughs> oh, man. All right. Let me see how we do against Mama Jean. Let's rock out. Yeah, which move are you going to do? I'm going to iframe me, so I got to wait. Uh, got guard broken on the fort there. But it don't matter because she done. This is about as high as we can do at 70. Because after that, uh, the damage just falls off. A cliff! Because you gotta be level 80, partner. Okay, so you can see the damage definitely falls a bit in the second phase here. Okay, let's, let's rush her now. Okay, I gotta move. Knew she was gonna teleport and dash. Thirteen? Ah, uh, not quite yet. Close. I do like the fact that she spends a lot of time in iframes for um, World Boss. That's very good. However, I'm looking at this and I'm thinking to myself, for ABX and ABL, if she's in iframes, the boss and specifically the mobs won't move. And that might be problematic. But I guess that's why you drag out the forward skill. Like when she is charging up, that's when the mobs are going to move towards you. Yeah. Oh, shit. I was trying to go in there and get her, but... Uh, she, she's, she's being a real see you next Tuesday, if you know what I mean. Yep. Oh, come on. <laughs> she didn't touch me once through this whole fight, and she still got in this place because she dragged it out by layering... I would say attacks that you kind of have to dodge on top of each other. That's Mama Jean for you, man. That's Mama Jean for you. Okay, let me just run back so I don't have my mind destroyed by this witch. And it's over. Absolutely. Love this girl. I <laughs> uh, can't wait to get her to tier 4, bro. I think she's definitely going to be one of my clears. Alright, let me see how this goes. I know I could be using Dazzler, but since I have the artifact for Valkyrie, Valkyrie offers more. Ooh, so close. I was hoping to one tap. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, 
That's a wrap. Let's go. Boom, boom. One shot. One and done. Love to see it. Nice. Gonna move. Gotta say, her V pad isn't very, like, I would say, flashy or cool. It's not as sticky as Luna Snows, that's for sure. Like, you can actually, I would say, easily control where you go, whereas Luna Snow, yours, um, your V pad skill kind of makes you feel like you're a dragon ass and fighting against where the character actually wants to go. Hers feels like you have more control, but it's not very cool, I would say. It is. It's interesting to see her, like, surf a little bit, but it's not anything, like, amazing so that kind of sucks and it doesn't feel like it's a necessary skill so that also kind of sucks because it's a cool effect on a skill that is pretty much never used you know i think the v pad should have probably gone on the fifth skill so you could move around if you need to while you're like in an iframe and attacking like that's dope that kind of would be like um gambit's fifth skill all right so CTP of Judgment, no Dazzler Artifact, and level 70. Let's see how my girl does. Just gonna pop off everything onto the, the fist kill. Let's go. Not gonna lie, for a judgy, we ain't doing too bad. Okay, I'm gonna have to go get that light. And they put it deep. I think I could be playing her better. For using a judgment, I need to be able to. I, need, I should be moving around a lot more than if you were using like a in a, sorry a, a rage because you want to build well even an energy like obviously you move around to get the beat down. You also move around to get the the type. So rage. It's superior because you don't have to do none of that movement shit. Yeah, I definitely could be at, at 5 mil here already. Damn, force skill looks like it has a range thing. Definitely could be faster. Seeing some lag, not sure if that's coming from my end or the game, but usually af just after we, come on man, just after we get an update, a lot of people downloading the patch, a lot of things happening. So lag definitely doesn't help when it comes to these kind of modes either. Shit. So it looks like we're gonna get just over six mil, maybe 6.5. I definitely think you could get 7 million with a judgment, which is very, very good. Because that means it's possible to get maybe like, pull up, like 8 mil with a rage. Yeah, because we're so close to 7 million already. And this is my first attempt, very first attempt. Right? And I could have gotten 7 million with a judgment. No Odin's, no nothing. That is very, very good, right? No Dazzler Artifact too. So I think she is very much going to replace Storm at the very least. Now do keep in mind that Storm has what I think every seasonal should have. 
and that is fallback value where now that she's being pushed out of the meta even further i have her up here because i'm going to strip all of her odin's right so because she's no longer a strong dps she can fall back on her support value with 55 percent elemental damage and 30 percent ignore dodge chef's kiss okay that's amazing fallback value Psylocke will not have that so when she falls out of the meta as a dps she's gone pretty much until she gets another uniform or like tier 5 or some shit so do keep that in mind but for now uh, i gotta say she is looking fantastic for not having anything on her i think my storm got about like 9 million 9 10 million ish with max odin's and a cdp of rage 